Welcome back on this Monday. Showing some patriotic pride for a class assignment got a California teenager a shocking reaction from her teacher. 13-year-old Taryn Hathaway drew an American flag like this one, only hers with little dots. Under uh, the words, God bless America, were also on it. It was all part of the art class. When her teacher saw the picture, the teacher, the teacher told Taryn, you can't draw that. That's offensive. Meantime, the same teacher apparently praised the picture of President Obama drawn by another student in the class. Well, join us right now from the state of California, Taryn Hathaway, the girl who drew the American flag picture, and her mom, Tracy. Good morning to both of you. Good morning. Okay, so Taryn, the teacher says, okay, uh, let's, let's draw anything you want. Why did you decide to do the American flag? Because I felt like I wanted to, I have my freedom of speech, so I just drew whatever I wanted to, and I decided oh. to draw the American flag. All right, and the teacher walked by, looked over your shoulder, and they really said, that's offensive, you can't do it? Yeah. Why do you think they said that? What, what, what was the teacher talking about? She just said it was offensive. She never said why it was offensive. All right. Now, Tracy, when you heard that uh, the teacher had walked by and said that the flag with God Bless America was offensive, and the other kid's uh, picture with Barack Obama, oh, that's a, that's a beautiful uh, piece of work you've done. When you heard that, what was your reaction? I was in utter shock. I, I didn't understand why the one thing that brings our country together and unites us, as the American flag does, was offensive to somebody. Right. But at the same time, the president who, um, for whatever reason, people disagree with what he's doing, um, was okay with her and it was not offensive right. and it, it just really to me didn't mesh well together and, tra um, and Tracy the, the, the school looked into it and the, the and the school apparently wanted the teacher to then apologize because apparently it was over the line uh, has your daughter mm -hmm. gotten the apology yet no not yet mm. no well Taryn uh, wh what do you think was going on there why did the teacher say that I don't know I have no idea. She never said why. Mm -hmm. Tracy, what do you yeah, think? Yeah, we. Well, we had asked in the meeting with uh, with our daughter's principal and the teacher. You know, what part was offensive? The God Bless America or the American flag, flag itself? Excuse me. And right. she really didn't have an answer for okay. us. And we kind of thought that was quite telling and interesting. Yeah. All um, right. Well, here so. is the official statement from the superintendent. Uh, they say, I asked the administration to contact parents again to see if there are any expectations from prior contact that have not been met. The principal did so mm -hmm. and indicated the parents were satisfied that the situation has been handled. But you still want an apology because you haven't gotten one, right? Exactly. Um, the initial contact I believe he's talking about is uh, the, the day that the principal had okay. contacted the other student. And I was satisfied with the fact that my daughter was vindicated, okay. um, but have yet to, sure. like we say, receive an apology for her behavior All right. um, uh, Taryn, towards our daughter. If it's any consolation, I think it's a beautiful flag. You, you, have, uh, you do lovely work. And uh, we thank you and thank your mother you. for both joining us today from California. All right. Thank you. Thank you. All right. What do you